Last time on Final Fantasy 16, we went up against the Great Clan King or whatever his name was. We got out of Sandros and had to fight him twice. But we succeeded, we survived, and we are back in the hideaway, about to go talk to Mid now that all these side quests and hunts for the current area are done. And Mid is gonna build a workshop of some sort. Not sure what that's about, but I'm sure she will happily tell us. Considering she is very energetic and persuasive, to put it nicely. She got a lot of traits from her father, just not her looks. Hello, Mid. All right, Clive. You've all done then. I am. I've placed your various orders, and a carpenter by the name of Bernard is on his way from Martha's Rest. That's brilliant. Thanks, Clive. Is there anything else you need? Nope. Blackthorn and Lady Karen have already sent over everything I asked for, and I've got all my plans drawn up. So as soon as Bernard gets here, we can get to work. <laughs> I can't wait. I am a little bit worried about what the hell you're going to be doing here. This is our uh, secret base after all. I prefer... This is wind up cooldown time. Huh? That's right, we also got Ifrit and I'm That's learning how to... Not Ifrit, Titan. Let's see how Jill's faring. And I'm learning how to use Titan. Really? Just like that, there's more side quests. Right here. I suppose it's safe to come see uh, Jill though. Clive. Taya. How's Jill? Recovering, but she still needs her rest. Of course. Take good care of her, won't you? I'll do my best. Oh, Gav was looking for you. He said he had something to show you in the shelves. Okay. The shelves. Oh, that's right. He went to ask Hippocrates about Togo. Right, our doggo also transformed and became a lightning doggo. So many questions. You have the look of a man with the twins upon his shoulders, Rodrigue. Taya has tasked me with removing a curse breaker's brand. But it's my first time and I, I don't think I can do it. I'm afraid of what happens if I fail. You survived, I know, but here as many die as recover. Oh, that's why they don't remove really the brand very often. Risk. You don't need me to answer that. You know full well what we're fighting for. I hope as much as you is the, the one brain day somehow magically among us as equals. But until that day, a brand is a burden, and we must lift that burden in order to go undetected. The operation may be dangerous, but it's also essential, and we undergo it willingly. I oh, know. I still wish there was some other way, but griping about my lot helps no one, I suppose. Don't worry. I'll do what must be done. I know you will. Unfortunately, the first thing that he's doing is the preparation of a draft to dull the pain. Anesthesia. Something I can't do with the infirmary's ammonia supply so low. What few leaves we have would barely be enough for removing a splinter, let alone a brand. So we're gonna go fetch some. Just paint. tell me what you need. Okay. You you'll go. Oh, thank you. No one knows Herblore like Taya, and she swears by ammonia for easing pain. It's simple enough to find if you know where to look. Is that meant to sound so much like you, ammonia? Along the river near the village of Amber over in Rosaria. Just search for the bright blue. Hey, I know where that is. We got chased out of that town. I assume if I come around here, Jill's here? Hey, I'm feeling Jill. a lot better, thanks to Taya's remedies. But she insists I rest. And you better listen to her. No leaving until she says you can. Hey, Nectar. 
Do you have any additional hunts for me now? You do not. Okay. Well, that's a blessing then. Love it. Haven't you heard? Mid's back. Things are about to get very interesting around here. Do you have a moment, Sid? A team of curse breakers has gone missing near Northreach. Oh, well, that's not Which good. Team? Coles. They were sent to liberate a carriage of bearers before they could be smuggled to market. They were moving in for their assault when the carriage was attacked by goblins. A curse Ooh. breaker managed to release a stolas amid the confusion, but <sighs> this was days ago. They should be back by now, but I've heard nothing from any of them. I can't help but worry that... They know the work is dangerous. But I'm sure they're fine. But what if I've got them all killed? <sighs> if they Before died, the it wasn't your fault. Why we're doing this. What they escaped. And what we're freeing people from. But they're all doing this willingly. But I never really thought how my words might affect them. What risks they might take because of the things I've said. I'll go and find them. We'll both rest easier knowing they're safe. Thank you, Sid. And I'm sorry to trouble you with this. The plan was to intercept the slaver somewhere in the dragon's airy. Oh, God. I can't tell you much more than that, I'm afraid. That should be enough to go on. If they were there, Torgal will track them down. Well, yeah, it's not like me saying that, even if I was saying in character, that me saying, hey, Jill, they knew what they were getting into, it's not your fault, will help her feel better about it. But that's the reality of it, is that, you know, they're all here fighting for a is cause, they're going willingly. Or pleasure? Go on then. Okay, oh. I filled up on my potions the last time, perfect. Let's go do some side quests. Always pressing the wrong button there. Uh, you will start with the Northreach one. <sighs> Slavers don't even pull. Now, do I remember? I do! Ready, girl? I should say, for uh, people watching this on yeah. YouTube, it has been about a month since I last played this, so I am going to be absolutely trash for a while while I get you to control it again. Sorry about that. Oh yeah, that that's just them. They're just right there. Hey, Cole. Cole, I'm glad you're in one piece. Just about. Sid, if you don't mind me asking, what are you doing here? Doris sent me to find you. She hasn't heard anything since the attack. She's been worried about you. Oh, Solus must be a carry mission. The hideaway should have learned of our survival yesterday. Well, I'm here now. And it looks like you freed the bearers. Only some. The rest locked themselves in the slaver's carriage rather than fleeing when they had the chance. I want to help them, Sid. But we're barely in any state to protect those few we did save. You made the right decision. Now where's the carriage? The goblins may still be out there. And? You have duties to attend to here. Goblins won't be much of a threat to me. I'll handle the rest. <sighs> Alright. Just follow the path to the south. You'll come across the carriage soon enough. And please, hurry. If the beastmen get to those bearers, the poor souls will be eaten alive. I won't let that happen. Thank you. And Sid, it's good to see you. Oh, I'm sure. Don't me just yet. Uh, so... Yeah, okay, that's one that leads to the dragon's area, right. Uh... I must have crossed the bridge to get there, okay. This is the area I want to come explore while we're out here. But Get me first, back on my feet. Tear those bastards in. Let's go deal with this quest. They didn't exactly get very far, did they? They're trying to get into the carriage. 
Yes, I remember. Good. I do remember how to play. Maybe not as much as I thought I did. Right, I don't have my uh, closing abilities on this setup. There we go. I feel like that timing was uh, too good to be true, really. There we go. Okay. Getting the timing down for that. Come on, man. Just, I'm learning how to fight again. So I'm not going to be the most elegant at first. There we go. But into a parry. That's okay. That was expected, I got through each of it. Big. This guy is much easier to practice that on than the clan ones. There we go. Yeah, I could have timed that better so I got that kill in while he was staggered, but oh well. As said, first fight in like a month, I'm happy with how that went. Who are you? A friend. Are there any more survivors? Just the two of you? Okay. Why didn't you flee with the others? If the goblins had made it through that door, you wouldn't have stood a chance. Why should we run? One miserable death's no worse than another. Perhaps. But we're here to give you another choice. Yeah, I mean, Freedom, safety, death isn't the choice that you've got been here. Denied. Come with us. Let us protect you. Sid, I, I couldn't just let you... You weren't too late then. Thank the gods. This man risked his life to save yours. To give you a second chance. Fine. Do with us what you will. What we'll do with you is take you to safety. Yeah. Like, come After on. That it's up to you. What they'll do is take your you to safety, feed you, clothe you, you can leave and the rest to us, give you a chance. We'll get everyone back to the hideaway. Thank you. I'll let Doris know we're expecting new arrivals. And just like that, we win. I do need to report back to Doris, but I will do that easily enough once I get over there. And now, I want to set a marker over there. Come back to Northreach, and then we're going to go exploring. Because now is the best opportunity we've had to do so. Keep them pilgrims nice and chill. Look at this place. This is no time to ride. We're outside the city limits. It's totally a time to ride. Run like the wind. Now let's see what's over in this little corner that we haven't been able to find for. Time to fight. Enemies that are actually a decent level, apparently. Just thinking that maybe this is a future area.
Oh, that leads back into Lost Wing. Okay. Interesting. Yeah, no. I don't want to fight any spiders, so let's run. And a dragon Avis, which I also don't particularly want to fight. I just want to see what's here. Ah, uh, there's a chest. I will thank you not to attack my bird. That's the launch. That, there we go, and broken. And that was a waste, but I oh. was. Come on, build up quicker, please. There we go. Perfect timing. Damn it, that was not perfect timing, but staggered and. Griffin's head frayed. What the hell is that gonna be? While it is true that large felines make a home of the Dalmetian desert, the sails of the flying lion with a mane of living flame and a race just as far as after Lacius. Most likely the result of a chance encounter with a long-haired cat ill-sarred enough to have been caught in a brush fire. Increases burning blade damage by 7%. Which I'm not using burning blades, so... Hello, Ambrosia. I'm sorry you got attacked earlier. You didn't deserve that. Okay. We have one more little area here to check out, which should be just out here. And then once we've done that, we can head on over to the other side first. Uh, okay, so it is just enemies a lot of enemies okay thanks gal come on You bring fire? There we go, magic birds. That's the timing I'm looking for. Okay. Well then. That didn't quite work out the way I wanted, but every time 
press the wrong button. I press the record button instead of the map button, menu button. Oh, okay, just over there. That's not far at all. That's actually Come pretty on. close to where we fought the Flan King. I have a feeling if I hadn't uh, already defeated the Flan King, I would have had to fight him. Not for those herbs. This might take a while. He deserve a rest. This calls for this calls for not giving a damn. And then once we're done with the raptors. Yeah, no, I was not done with the raptors. That's on me. Come on, just die already. That's what I want. Because the best way to deal with little flying enemies like this is with Garuda because she can pull them in. Okay. Let's, let's gather some ammonia. This is the only plant around here with blue flowers. I hope it's the right one. Yes, so do I, but I'm sure it will be. Should be enough to keep the infirmary stocked for a while. Hopefully this will put Rodrigo's mind at ease. Which means we can head on back to the hideaway. The little ones have been up to their old tricks again. Destroying on the deck. Doris, we saved them. Sid, welcome back. A Stolas from the Dame arrived. Thought I had frozen. Remember them? If I'd just waited a little longer, I might have been able to deal with things myself. Or maybe I wouldn't. I keep making the wrong decisions. Cole and the others got home safely. You made exactly the right decision. No. I was lucky. I've been tracking that slaver for months, and then I sent Cole and you after them woefully unprepared. I mean, they were what prepared kind of for the slavers. Sends people into danger without considering all the risks. You can't control I their monsters. With greater caution, told Cole to be wary, to pull back at the first sign of trouble. We swore the same oath as you, Doris. It's good to see you safe and well, Cole. Like, really? I'm you sorry. go easy on yourself, With Doris. With due respect, we curse breakers don't risk our lives because you commanded of us. We risk them because we believe in our cause. No one with doubts ever joins our ranks. The agony of removing the brand more than sees to that. We all know how much bravery that takes. Cole, I never doubted your courage. Only my ability to see it put to good use. I still don't think. Thank removing you the brand does me. much for them like it's still very sure visible that it. they had a brain i sometimes wonder if i might prefer to risk death alongside the others than ask it of them but i'm a curse breaker i swore an oath saw to a bunch of people with this strange burnt burnt mark i must like, trust that, that i'm the right one pattern. to play it you might start to get wise in time it seems like a bit of a Bad idea by them. Oh, 
Well, n n bad idea is the right word. They would have been treated badly otherwise. But I feel like anyone worth their salt isn't going to be uh, fooled by it. I hope you didn't have too much trouble finding the ammonia. Here you go. Only the usual. Oh, yes. This is it. And more than I was expecting. I dare say the patient won't feel a thing. That is, unless I... You'll do fine. Again, have faith Don't in you yourself. You. Which means I trust you. The hideaway would be lost without skilled physicists like yourself. Thank you for the kind words. Truly. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm still terrified. The brand is more than just ink on flesh. It's a death sentence. Milk of the wyvern tail lurking just below the surface of the Wait, skin. Wait, what? One ill-conceived incision, a single slip, and the poison fouls the patient's blood. Failure okay. means death. And even success that means explains tremendous it, pain. Days of agony as the wound heals. I became a physicist to help people, not to kill them. I, I, I don't want to kill anyone. Curse breakers lead hard lives. And the operation is only the beginning. They toil in the shadows, risking life and limb. Knowing their efforts will win them neither glory nor acclaim. And yet we never won for volunteers. Why do you think that is? Conviction? They're willing to die? They're willing to fight. Yeah, that's a bit of a better way to put it. lives to create a world where people like us can be more than mere possessions. I know your work isn't easy. But neither is going under the knife. Be a shoulder for your patients to lean on. Stay strong for them. <laughs> you sound like Tyre. Do you know what she once told me? Man up. It's up here. natural. For a patient to feel like they're suffering in solitude. Hey, that's a nice of thing to tell you. To see that they don't. Thank you for helping me remember that. I won't falter. Not again. Quest complete. Perfect. Not quite at a level, but that's okay. Okay, well, first side quest out of the way. Next time on Final Fantasy 16, we'll pick up our rewards and then go see Gavibara Doggo. See you then.